Hey everybody, this is part two of my CoverGirl Press Powder Compact. And I'm going to show you how to remove this powder part out of this newer style compact. And I'll take this one, this powder part, as you see. The powder is just about gone. I take this part out of my classic style compact, which you'll see. To take this powder part out of the newer style compact. I use a steak knife right here that you see. And I'm going to put this plastic. I'm going to put it on top of this powder part right here. And I'm going to carefully insert this knife, the tip of the knife, right here, carefully. And I'm going to gently remove this powder part. As you see, I know sometimes it's hard, and I just about got it. I think I got it. Okay, I just about got it. Hold on, it's coming, it's coming. Okay. And sometimes it is a struggle, but I got it. Okay, you see right here. I was able to take the powder part out. As you see. You see, this is the powder part right here. And you don't want to, you know, poke the pile apart, which I see I sort of did because just only just a little bit, so it's no biggie. As you see, okay, and now I'm going to. Move this pile apart right here out of my classic style compact. Use this knife, use the tip end of this knife, and I'm carefully turn it this way, make it easy. Okay, I'm gonna carefully remove this part. Okay, I got it. Most likely you insert the tip of the knife between the gap. Right there. As you see, just like that. Sometimes 
sometimes I have to clean this part out. So I'm going to clean this out real quick. Okay, I got it clean. As you see. And now I'm going to put this part, the powder part. Yeah, this powder part right here that you see. Okay, here we go. Just like that. And now, I got the powder part inside my CoverGirl Classic Style Compact. So lucky the sticky part was still on the back of the powder part and some of it, the sticky part inside of the classic style compact. As you see, I moved this plastic part real quick. And, and like that, As you see. So it's easy to remove, but sometimes it's hard, you know, to get the powder part out of that newer style compact. So I use this plastic part right here. Put it on the powder. I put the plastic part on the powder and then I put the puff. This is the puff right here. Yep, and put the puff on top of the plastic. Yep, and then after that, close the compact. Like that. And there you have it. So, like I mentioned in my last video, my CoverGirl Press Pilot Compacts, that this classic style compact is better than the newer style compact. I'll go ahead and put this part right here. I'll put it inside this new design compact. I just about don't use up all this powder anyway. And you should see, it's sometimes hard to get the rest of the powder onto the puff. Right here. So I'm going to put this part back inside this newer style compact. Just like that. Then just go ahead and put the puff back in.
anyway, that's it. So that's how I do remove the powder part out of the new style compact and put it inside my classic style compact after I move that other powder part out of the classic style compact. So But anyway, that's it.